In this question, we're asked to solve an equation involving a sine squared theta and a cos theta. Now, to solve this equation, we need to have either just a sine or just a cos. But we've got both sines and coses. However, there's one key identity which you must know, which is that sine squared theta plus cos squared theta equals 1. So I can find sine squared in terms of cos. Sine squared theta equals 1 minus cos squared theta. So back to the equation. I can sub in 1 minus cos squared theta where we have a sine squared theta. So 5, 1 minus cos squared theta equals 5 plus cos theta. If I expand the bracket, 5 minus 5 cos squared theta equals 5 plus cos theta. The 5s cancel out. If I then add across the 5 cos squared theta, I get 0 equals cos squared theta times 5 plus cos theta. This can then be factorised to cos theta. 5 cos theta plus 1 equals 0. So therefore, either cos theta equals 0, or cos theta equals minus 1 over 5. So to find theta, we have to use our calculator and the inverse cos function. So the first solution is theta equals inverse cos of 0, which if you're not sure about, you press shift cos 0, and the answer will be 90. There's one more solution to start off with, which is theta equals inverse cos of minus a fifth. So shift cos of minus 1 over 5. And that gives us 101.5 degrees. However, they are not the only solutions. The question asks for all the solutions between 0 and 360. And the cos graph repeats itself more than once in this interval. And there's a goal of the cos, which is to find another solution, we do 360 degrees minus this key value here. So 360 minus 90 is 270 degrees. And 360 minus this value, I refer back to the, the accurate number there. So 360 minus the accurate value gives us 258.5 degrees. Now, just to show that this is the case, if you do cos of 270, we do indeed get 0. And if we do cos of 258.5, we do indeed get minus a fifth, approximately, with a bit of rounding error. So with cos, between 0 and 360, there are actually two values you can find. And it's always 360 minus the first value, 360 minus the first value, and they are the four solutions.